What's up guys, we're back with the latest news and it seems like Exynos is on. Samsung has just come out with their brand new trailer for the Exynos 21er chip and you can see with these hashtags and everything, they are super duper confident. And now we might know the reason behind that confidence and that is three letters, AMD. Even though the Exynos 2100 won't be using a AMD based graphics, still AMD has apparently played a key role in the development of Exynos 2100. According to the rumors coming from South Korea, AMD helped Samsung fine tune the CPU and GPU of this brand new chip. The AMD based Exynos chip is expected to come next year, but we may not have to wait that long because according to Ice Universe, as far as current information goes, this might actually happen this year. I Universe tweeted out that Exynos 2100 is just the beginning of what Samsung is about to do and what we all want to see will also happen and that is first ever Exynos chip with AMD RDNA graphics. Now Ice Universe also further expects Samsung to completely ditch Qualcomm and end it all. He tweeted out saying that Samsung could adopt Exynos processors in all regions of the world. That absolutely makes sense because with the AMD GPU the Exynos chip could even surpass Apple. And at that level Samsung should stick with their own homegrown chip. By the second half of this year we're gonna hear some official word with Samsung and AMD collaboration and if all goes well this is a goodbye for Qualcomm. Samsung may very well go all Exynos starting with Galaxy S22. There are also rumors going on that Samsung may actually use Exynos processors on their foldable Z lineup something they have yet to do. Again super excited for January 12th where we're gonna see the official official Exynos 2100 chip. Now Isonewares further confirmed that Charger is getting cancelled with the Galaxy S21 lineup. We already have heard about this numerous times. I feel like it's definitely going to happen for all markets. Also in the news, a mobile network carrier from Germany has published almost all specification for the S21 series. Literally everything from display specs to camera, RAM, storage, even the pricing in Europe all is here. Now along with this leak, we also have some more official images of the S Pen coming with the S21 Ultra. To store this S Pen, this is the official case that you will have to buy separately. It's the LED view and silicon cover case made for the S21 Ultra. Again, in case you don't know, this S Pen won't have Bluetooth, which means it's gonna lose on all those S Pen remote functions, but users will still be able to enjoy that nine millisecond delay, take advantage of air commands, which will let you scroll through uh, web pages or playback video, all those functions within the close range. So that's all the latest news. It seems like AMD may have played an important role in the development of the Exynos 2100 and obviously they're going to play a big big role with the future Exynos chip and with that Samsung could finally finally ditch Qualcomm for good. Be sure to subscribe to the channel for latest tech videos and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.